Hi, I'm Steve Tragars, Engineering Manager for Sagami Rem Sales. Thank you for joining me today to learn more about one of our best-selling Swiss turn models, the Sagami S206 Mark II. But before we begin, if you have any questions along the way, please feel free to type them in the chat box and we will have the opportunity to answer them at the end of this session. Sagami is the world's largest builder of Swiss-style CNC machines. They produce more machines than any of our competitors and are known worldwide for speed, accuracy, and rigidity. REM Sales has been the exclusive importer of Sagami for all of North America for the past 45 years. We import 31 different Sagami models, which allows us to specifically tailor the ultimate manufacturing solution for our customers. In partnership with local Sagami distributors, we have you covered with local support with over 17 application engineers and 15 factory service technicians. We understand efficient manufacturing and the need for maximum uptime. Now let's take a look at the Sagami S206 Mark II 20 mm Swiss style lathe. The S206 is one of the heaviest 20 mm machines in its class at 8,400 pounds. It's designed with heavier castings, bases, and larger bearings, giving it the rigidity it needs for heavier cutting capabilities. The S206 is complemented with 10,000 RPM spindles on the main and sub, and are both rated at five horsepower. The main spindle stroke is 210 millimeters, or just over eight and a quarter inches, to help minimize the number of regrips required when producing longer parts that Swiss machines are known for. To maximize clamping force, a three toggle system that's typically used on larger machines has been incorporated into the spindle design. Large spindle bores allow maximum diameter material to be run without bar and prep, and optionally we can increase the capacity to 26 millimeters on both spindles. Like all Sagami models, the main spindle is convertible from Swiss to chucker mode, which can be accomplished in minutes, keeping quick changeovers times in mind. The standard guide bushing is a direct drive eliminating any vibration that could possibly be transferred from a belt or gear-driven assembly. Another option we offer for the guide bushing is the SmartFlex guide bushing. The SmartFlex system is designed to create consistent support when machining less than favorable quality bar stock. It can also improve roundness after machining by providing even pressure around the bar at all times. The pressure settings required are adjusted easily by pneumatic regulator during the setup process, then controlled by M code in the program. Changing the guide bushing collet only takes about three minutes. The Sagami S206 Mark II has nine turning positions on the front and rear gang for the main spindle, plus seven milling units and five static drilling positions. The opposing gang slides are at the three o'clock versus the competitor's 12 o'clock designs, which helps to eliminate chip wrap and also results in faster chip to chip times, being there's less distance to travel between tools. The four position front milling unit is rated at 10,000 RPM and has one offset ER16 that can hold up to a 30 millimeter diameter saw. The rear modular milling unit for the main is rated at 8,000 RPM and one and a third horsepower. As a matter of fact, the milling units they use are the same modular units we use on our 32 millimeter machines and some of our 38 models as well. We offer many types of cross face milling units from three to four time cross speeders to double fixed or adjustable angle milling units. We also have quad units that can mill on the main and sub simultaneously. Many of these units are optionally available with quick change that have been designed and manufactured for REM sales by Sooner in Switzerland. In addition, we have whirling, gear hobbing, and polygon milling units available from Sagami. Most all units we have in inventory. Another unique feature, there are two deep hole drilling units mounted next to the subspindle that are ideal for gun drilling. We also have an option to replace them with milling units that are geared directly off the subspindle. 
The back block has eight positions that can be all live or static. The live tools are modular as well, plus the top row can accommodate cross billing units. They too are rated at 8,000 RPM and the Y axis slide has 70 millimeters of total stroke. There are also four position static blocks that are optional, increasing the capacity of the back machining to 12 tools total. To help decrease changeover times, many quick change systems are available from companies like Kenametal or Sandvik, to name a few, and are available without any modifications to the machine. We also offer Gottenbolt GWS systems for the front and rear gang, as well as the ID drill block. Their unique precision ground double rail design has repeatability that is unparalleled by similar systems. The holders accept standard square shank tooling, then mount to the rails. There's also a special clamping system that draws the holder back into place, allowing one-handed accurate replacement. Tool presetters that are available allow redundant tools to be set outside the machine, regardless of the type, so you're ready to go when it's time to swap out a tool. The Sagami S206 Mark II is controlled by a Fanuc Series 32i Model B dual path that comes standard with a 10.4 color LCD loaded with options. From 512 kilobytes of memory, all the CAN cycles, custom macro B, cylindrical, helical, and polar interpolation, 0.1 micron specifications with 10 millionths minimum increment capability, plus cutoff breakage detection, just to name a few of the key options out of over 40 that are standard with the Sagami S206 Mark II. With custom macro B and the available user variables, it's ideal for programming families of parts which can make changeover fast and simple as calling up another program or loading new variables. Programming for first-time Swiss users is made simple with Sagami's own proprietary Abile software. It comes included with the purchase of each machine and is specific for that model. Sagami's Abile is simple building block style of programming where the programmer describes the shape of the part selects the features from a pull-down menu, and, and entering the data directly off his blueprint for the part. He then selects tooling, material, speeds, feeds from the database embedded in the software. When you're done, it generates a program that can be downloaded directly into the control. Abile software is perfect for the entry-level user, introducing them to the Swiss world and multiple path controls taking care of all the weight codes. And of course for the advanced user, purchasing post-processors from companies like Esprit, Partmaker, and Mastercam are readily available. Another optional feature available on the Sagami S206 Part II is Sagami's Oscillation Cutting. Oscillation Cutting is a technological breakthrough that oscillates the servo axis to help break chips in tough to cut materials. It reduces heat in the cut while not diminishing the tool life. This function oscillates specified axis and cutting is performed by synchronizing the oscillation of that specified axis with the rotation of the spindle. Interruption in the cut is what breaks material in the smaller chips. This function can be used for turning, drilling, boring, grooving, or cutoff operations. Oscillation cutting is performed by specifying a dedicated G-code and remains valid until canceled by another dedicated G-code. The oscillation data is calculated based on the spindle speed and the feed rate of the specified axes. The oscillation per revolution and depth of oscillation are specified easily within the program. Plus, the servo learning feature ensures that the oscillation code that was programmed is exactly what was executed, which ultimately eliminates any tweaking of the program to break chips properly. And finally, servo learning oscillation is strictly software. There's no hardware needed for this function, plus Sagami machines are specifically built to perform oscillation cutting functions right from the factory. 
So it looks like we're running out of time today. So in conclusion, the Sagami S206 Mark II is the best 20 millimeter Swiss turn in its class. If you want to lower cycle times, achieve better finishes, and desire unparalleled production stability, please reach out to us for personalized attention for you and your business. Check us out at www.remsales.com or don't hesitate to call us at 866-224-8576. Now let's answer your questions.